2024 presidential candidate Tim Scott is in Yuma today where he hosted a roundtable discussion with community leaders and those on the front lines of the border crisis. Good evening, I'm Jessica McLean. Samantha Bird was there at the roundtable and shares details from the discussion. The U.S. Senator from South Carolina said part of his agenda is to crush the cartels, secure the border, and end illegal immigration. A virtual sign, not a literal sign, that says that your border is wide open, even though it's insecure and unsafe. You cannot expect six million people to come through the country without creating a, a real crisis. Presidential candidate Tim Scott says he plans to finish the border wall started during former President Trump's administration if elected to the White House. One of the things that you can do very quickly to solve that problem is to finish the wall. I think the cost of that wall would be around $10 billion. Senator Scott not only toured the Yuma border during his visit, but also spoke to local leaders about issues important to our community, starting with agriculture. The Yuma area is home. It's critical, not just to our operation. It's critical to, as you have seen, uh, to the food supply in the United States. Yes. The candidate also heard from the local food bank as the border crisis also overwhelmed their organization. About 250,000 individuals annually through the food bank. That now is up to 340,000. Scott says he plans to take the information he learned in Yuma along his campaign trail as he continues his run for president. This is Scott's first visit to the border as a 2024 GOP candidate. Reporting in Yuma, I'm Samantha Bird.